Good morning, Washington Patriots, and happy Thursday, January 14th, 2021. Don't forget, our meal program schedule is available on Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Fridays, and today is Thursday, so we will see you at the front of the school from 11.15 a.m. to 12.45 p.m. Let's go on to our quote of the day. The world is full of nice people. If you can't find one, be one. So think about what that means and our character counts. We always want to make sure we're showing empathy for others and reflecting genuine kindness. Moving on to our fun fact for today. Have you ever wondered why cats do not like water? Some say domestic cats hate water because they aren't around it early in life. If cats don't spend much time in water as kittens, they're more likely to be afraid of it. This is a common problem because many pet owners don't bathe their cats since felines groom themselves. Another explanation has to do with evolution. Cats are what experts call semi-domesticated. That means they still have some instincts from their wild ancestors. Cats don't like surprises, and they like to stay agile in case they need to escape a threat. Wet fur can weigh a cat down, making them move slower. That means cats may think water puts them in danger, making them less able to run away if they need to. Do all cats hate water? No, of course not. In fact, several members of the feline family like water a lot. This is especially true of large cats that live in hot climates. Tigers, jaguars, and leopards are good swimmers. They often go for a dip to cool off on hot days. Let's check on our journal topic for today. What clothes do you think are the most comfortable? What kind of clothes do you like to wear the most? What clothes do you not like to wear? I think the most comfortable piece of clothing for me is probably a sweatshirt. Moving on to our joke for today. This joke was submitted by Avery G. at Washington in Mrs. Pena's class. What did the snail say when it was done with something? Snailed it. (laughs) And now on to our distance learning expectations for today and the flag salute. Our distance learning expectations for the day tie in with our character counts of trustworthiness. Attempt the work on your own. Be honest. Use devices properly. Limit distractions for yourself and others. Please join us for the pledge. Please stand and place your right hand over your heart. Ready? Begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you, Washington Patriots.